Hey everyone, we're gonna take you on a little journey through the solar system. It's Science Saturday, kids. Let's do this. So, what's this video gonna show you? It's gonna show you how enormous the solar system is. It's gigantic. Let's go, take a look. Go. Come on over here. What does this say? The planets are spaced out pretty accurate. Dude. Dude. Welcome to our solar system. First planet is Neptune. 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 Wait. Wait. We're going in the opposite direction. So we're starting from the end of the solar system and we're heading towards the sun. Let's go. Give you that crazy perspective. So first of all, we have Neptune Whoa. here. It's really cold. It's kind of bluish purple. It's got methane and has like methane rain, I think. Apparently, is it really cold? Yeah, it's really cold. So we have to take 30 steps all the way to get to... Uranus. What's the deal with Uranus? It's named after somebody's private part. What? Hey, no giggling at Uranus, okay? There's Uranus. It is on its side, flipped on its side. It's got a really small little ring around it. Then we take another 30 steps and we get to... Um, Saturn. Yes. What's cool about Saturn? It has um, a giant um, hula hoop over it. A hula hoop. Isn't that cool? And it's... It's so beautiful and you can see this bad boy in a regular telescope. So if you just get a normal telescope, you can actually see Saturn with your eyes. Bunch of tiny pebbles. All right, then we take another, what is it, 15 steps or so. Whoa, come back. What do we got here? Um, Jupiter. Oh, what's the deal with Jupiter? It's the biggest planet. Yeah, it's gigantic, isn't it? And Jupiter's my favorite planet. Yeah. Jupiter is the big protector. So what does that mean? I don't know. Things that are coming into our solar system, Get like... by Jupiter? Yeah, like that asteroids so and things. So they moons. smash into the gas giant, yeah, but Jupiter. The asteroid belt and there, Jupiter yeah. has tons of moons. Four of the biggest moons are the Galilean moons, and you can even see some of those with the telescope. Ooh. Hey, cool shirt, by the way. Thank you. <laughs> All right. This Along with the sun. That's the asteroid belt. There's a bunch of little asteroids. Then we take about five steps, I believe. Meter. That's Mars. Yes. And what's the deal with Mars? It's the smallest planet. It's uh, one of the smaller planets. It's red. Second smallest planet in... Okay, let's get something straight here, people. Are we going to move to Mars or what? Uh, the is that a good idea? Are... No. But... Why is that not a good idea? I mean, it... Might work, no, but not. Well, that's a dumb idea. Why is it a dumb idea? Dad, Elon Musk is going to sue you. No, he won't sue me. But listen, it's a dumb idea to try and live on Mars. Let's just try and fix Earth first, okay? Mars wants to kill us way worse than Earth. You can't breathe there. There's no running water. There's no food. It's ridiculous. It's freezing cold. Why do you want to live there? There's no atmosphere to protect you from radiation. Bad idea, okay? Let's not go to Mars. All right, moving on. And just a foot and a bit from there is home Earth. It takes about three years to get to Mars from Earth, and it would be a one-way mission. I don't think you're coming back if you go there. Anyway, so there's Earth. Earth um, spins around the sun and the moon spins around Earth. Awesome. And since Earth spins around the sun, and you're driving that way, yeah. the sun is going to follow you because Earth spins around. Oh, man. All right, so what's next to Earth? We have the V. What's that one? Venus. Venus. Ooh. Sister planet. It's about the same size, and it's super hot. It has, like, sulfuric acid rain. And it's just cooking hot there. And then we have Mer Mercury. Mercury. And then really close to the sun. sun. Oh, the big blazing sun. And is the sun a star? Yes. Smallest planet in the world. It in the world? You mean the? Universe. 
solar system, not in the universe, solar what system. Ever. And then we have Mercury. It's Yay! been all burnt up because it's so close to that massive sun. Big boy. So. And the massive sun, that's just a typical star. If you compare it to all the other billions of stars out there, There's it's kind of like medium to small size, and it's gonna burn for another five billion years or so. So we got lots of time. Yo, yo. Thanks for joining us on this solar system journey and yeah. Science Saturday. Thanks to my son here. Nice work. Awesome. Hey, thanks for the tour. Hello? Thanks for the You're tour. Welcome.